okay, we made a whole bunch of progress and a whole lot of messes. And so I thought I'd show you guys where we are now with Lucky's reimagining. Okay, so for now, we haven't built a bed in. We just put comfy things in. And so we've got these kneeling pads, which is what they're good for, is kneeling. And then we've got this, which is a four inch piece of memory foam, or part of it is memory foam anyway, that I got at Walmart. And then we have these cushions, which are basically dog beds. They that are exactly. Up, <laughs> that we picked up. And so it's super duper comfy. Doo -doo -doo -doo. And I can fit all the way in here and there's plenty of room up here for somebody slightly taller than me, like my husband. Okay. So eventually we will build a bed, but for now, this is where we are. So come on around to this side and I'll show you the galley. So we started with that baseboard in the back and then we put um, L brackets that look like this and we made the backboard for the bed, the headboard for the bed, and also the backboard for the kitchen wall. And then um, today we built this table. It's sort of a two layered table. And eventually right here is where the fridge is gonna go. We're not putting it in there right now, but it, we did have it in here a little while ago. Um, it's in there for when it fits just perfectly right in here between the table and here we can still open it from in there just got this little thing here hanging so that we can you know hang this and then i may put one around here to put spices and things like that this is a six gallon water tank um that i put fresh water in and that way I can continue to fill my ice water cooler, which I love. So I'm hoping to be able to find a way to fit that in here, but I don't know how that's happening yet. Right now, this is just one of a couple of bins that goes in here. Uh, it hasn't been packed. This is an old um, first aid bin that I used for trail magic that I just sort of stuck in here. This is sort of the pantry. So we're gonna have the ability to put the dishes in here, put food in here. Um, this, needs, this is from our last trip. We're getting rid of that. And this in here. And so we have the ability to, I've got like a little stool in there that's currently acting like a shelf, but um, that's inevitably gonna be a part of the bed, which you'll see later. We set this up so that we can fit trekking poles kind of in this little nook and we should be able to do that on the other side as well and it just gets to the place where it closes. Um, you know I suppose if you're like a fishing pole person or something like that then you would do that. Here's my sink so um, inevitably we will make this so that it will come out like a drawer or something here. But for right now, it's going in here. And we've got some fine china and some garbage bags. And then also in here is my stove. So I can just sort of pull that out. I've got this table here I can use. I can use the top of the cooler to cook on or I can cook right on this shelf for right now. Under here there's also another opening to get to the sort of garage. It's got um, right now it's just got like a like cords and an, a secondary stove and some more fuel just in case we need it. The other thing that's in here is my screens that you saw in a previous video that I put up if it's buggy but only then and then the magnets are also down here so that's pretty much it it all fits together pretty nicely I forgot to mention 
that this table comes out, this bottom part also comes out so that we can kind of get in or out or maybe put this on a table so we can access it differently if we want to or make it more flexible, turn it all around if we want to. So that's the other thing I forgot to say. And that's it, that's what we've got so far. And so that is an Explorer Sport Rack. And up there we have like some tarps, some chairs, and some spare, uh, what? Spare, what else do we have up there? Tarps, chairs, spare tents. Tents, um, our trash bag, shower tent. Um, oh yeah, the shower tent, which- Blankets. That's that down in the garage <laughs> was a little shower thing um, that I have already that I just, I'm not really super sure how I'm going to use that yet. And then this we will keep in the car. And then whenever we are at a stop, we'll pull it out, put it behind the vehicle. And that's it. That's where we are so far. It's pretty usable now. I'm super excited. So we finished the main part and I'm excited about that. We will give you a sort of a rundown of kind of what our cost was for the total build, including stuff that we thought we were going to use and didn't and what that cost us. Do update videos on little additions that we do as we go to make improvements and we'll give you a final cost video. Thanks for doing this with us. It's been a lot of fun so far. Can't wait to use it.